Ugh, the Christmas sweater you're wearing is absolutely hideous. Who the hell knitted that for you? Oh, your grandma? Uh, sorry. It's still ugly, sweetheart. I'm colorblind? Well, seems more likely to me that you make everything you wear look too good. No, no offense to your grandma. I'm sure she meant well. Okay, I'll shut up. Are you done with that stupid mistletoe? Do you even know how heavy you are? I'm not exactly a ladder, you know. My shoulders and bones aren't made of iron and steel. And I can only carry your ass for so long. <sighs> Ladders are made of aluminium. Okay, whatever, smartass. Come on, just finish fixing it up already. It's getting... <sighs> kind of hard to breathe down here. Ugh. <sighs> Ugh. <sighs> Be careful. You could have seriously hurt yourself. Did you hit anything? Turn around. Let me see your elbows. Hmm. I'm glad you're okay. I'm... <clears throat> what the fuck? Don't just grab me like that. <clears throat> Your family's around the corner. You wouldn't want them to know about us, would you? They're a sweet little child, going out with the bad boy. <laughs> look at you blush. Your room. It's fine, they won't look for us if we vanish for a couple of minutes. I've got a whole lot of making out to do with your lips. Take your sweater off. Why? Give me your hand. Touch me here. See how fast my heart's beating? That's because it's terrified of how hideous you look in that sweater. <laughs> now take it off. That's right. You look much nicer in my shirt. It's so big on you. What would your parents say if they find out, hmm? <laughs> Enough talk. Let's continue. Before it gets too late.